everybody. I'm going to show you how to uh, make a voice call or a video call in Microsoft Teams. I'm going to show you how to do it with more than one person because that's when it gets a little bit complicated. So the first thing you need to do is to get into Teams um, in general. So to start the call, I'm going to go over... Um, if you're going to call one person, it's pretty easy to start from calls over here. But if you're going to chat with multiple people in the voice call, it's a lot easier if you start actually in chat. Um, I'm, so I'm going to click chat. And then I'm going to start a new chat up here where this little box and this pencil icon is. And I'm going to start adding all the people that I want to video chat with. So um, right now I have it set up. We did a practice round already. I'm going to add Miss Phillips. And this crawls into my group. So you can do this, I think, uh, with over 100 people. I know sometimes people have it with thousands, but that, I know that could get really complicated. But you could definitely do this with a class. Um, and you could do it with your staff or your PLC group or whatever you needed to do. But I'm just going to do it with two people right now because those are the people standing by that are ready. Um, so I'm going to start a chat with them. And once I start this chat, we did this a minute ago, um, up here by their names, you're going to see a little camera icon and a little phone icon. If you want to do just a voice call, you can click the little um, phone, but we're going to try a video call. So I'm going to click video. And what it's going to do is it's going to try to call them. So I know my voice is probably behind this video, but that's fine. Okay, so I think they're picking up. Okay, there's Miss Phillips. And Miss Carlson should be popping up in just a minute. So when you answer the phone call, um, it'll give you an option to answer with just voice or with video as well. So um, there's a little, if you look right here on my toolbar, there's a little camera right here. So you could turn your camera on and off. You can mute yourself. And there's also an option for you to share your screen. So let's say you were working on something on your desktop and you would want them to see it. You could click here as well. Um, one of the things that we found out um, that's a little confusing about when you have a voice call is it's only going to show the person who talked most recently. It's not going to show everybody's video. So if Miss Croslin would say something, she should pop up instead of Miss Phillips. Ms. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Sometimes it takes a second. So she was the most recent one to talk. So um, a lot of this with the lag is going to be um, just uh, you're going to have to work through some of the issues trying to figure out who's talking with the video. But this is how you go between. So, Miss Phillips, will you talk again? So it'll go back. Hello. Can you see me now? Yep. So it'll load her video again and it goes back and forth depending on who's talking. Um, we tried to look through the settings and see if you could see everybody at once. But that's not how this is set up. Um, if we find anything else, I'll let you know. But that's the basics of how to make a video call. If you have questions, there's going to be an email at the end of this video that you can contact to let us know if you need any help. Thanks, guys. Bye.